how far is too far? Can you say truth it? Truth it. Truth it. Truth it. Truth it. Truth it. What up, God's people? This is your boy, and this is another episode of Truth It. That video you saw was taken outside of an abortion clinic in Worcester. Let me be clear. I am against abortion. Truth it. And I'm all for offering help and counsel to those who need help uh, going through such a difficult time in their lives. It's my job to tell people what the Bible says about value in life. Truth it. But what I saw in that video, that ain't biblical. Let's go to the Bible. John 3.17 says, for God did not send his son into the world to condemn the world, but in order that the world might be saved through him. Truth it. Being Christian means trying to be Christ-like. Trying to be, at least. I don't see Christ dressing up as the Grim Reaper. To further scare people away from Christ. Things like that don't win people to Christ. It pushes them further away. And not all people who stand out there with signs are mean-spirited either. Like, I saw across the street from them, one woman had a uh, problem pregnancy sign or something like that. And it, it said on it, you know, but if you, before you make this tough decision, contact us, we can help. And another one had a sign that said, if you need help, call us, we can pray for you. But it's to the point now, unfortunately, that those that are genuinely trying to help and, and, and trying to get into the matter of a pro-abortion versus abortion uh, really get outshined by these other people who try to use these scare tactics. That ain't biblical. So before we go correcting others, we should go to the Bible. And as always, make sure we're doing it the biblical way and in love. That's it for Truth it, and the truth shall set you free.